Hello friends, so this package we received today, okay. we ordered it from Amazon, it's a slider or mandolin. The first thing is the packaging was not good, when we received it, uh, the delivery person actually left it at the reception and uh, it was kind of open, so we were not sure. Uh, but how the product is whether the product is damaged or not but this is what was inside the box or inside the package and it was just packed in a big paper envelope that's it nothing was inside okay. so we can show this so this is not um, I'm not very happy with the packaging usually Amazon sells the product in good packaging but this was not so these are the things which were inside the envelope um, so one by one we'll see i bought it on amazon.co.uk so this is the name mandolin slicer 4.5 mm and 9 mm julian strip and 1 to 9 mm stepless slicer okay. so it's actually a vegetable slicer a mandolin okay. i bought it for uh, 21 pound and 89 uh, pence right okay. so they have given this leaflet instruction manual and then uh, a pair of gloves to protect our hand when we are slicing the vegetable i think this is very useful to me because i am not very careful when i uh, slice the vegetables and all and then what is this what is this called this is actually a safe, um, safety push-up we can uh, fix the vegetables whichever we are going to slice we can fix it here and then we can slice so this is also very helpful in keeping our hand protected and this is at the actual slide slicer or the mandolin i'll open it right now and this is a brush which we can use to clean so these three are actually um, additional uh, products for the protection of our hand um, because the mandolin blades are sharp and the chances of us cutting our finger is high if we are not careful. So this brush is to clean the blades and this is uh, where we can actually uh, fix the vegetable and slice it in this way. And this is the gloves, a pair of gloves to keep our hand protected. So uh, I am happy with this because I think uh, I am not very careful when I am uh, slicing the vegetables and most of the time I end up uh, uh, cutting my fingers or injuring myself. So I think this is something I need. Okay, I will open this now. Just open this package and let's see. It seems to be good though I am not happy with, very happy with the packaging but uh, they, as I said, they just send the product, the box, into one big uh, paper envelope, which I'm not happy. But otherwise, it seems to be good. I think so. This is how it should be fitting. It should stand. Okay. And uh, this is the instruction manual. We can read out. Okay. Fine. So. This is okay. This is something we just we have to cut it off, and uh, this is the knob where uh, we can set the different uh, sizes of the slice, uh, where we can decide the thinness of the slice, what we are going to cut, and also the thinness of the julians. Okay, so we have two. One is um, yeah. For the julienne we have, we have okay. so we have this julienne 9 mm and 4.5 mm over here 
and the we have four uh, different sets of five i think four have been set 0 mm 3 mm 6 mm and 9 mm uh, is the thickness we can set for the thickness of the slices this is how it should be we have to take this out okay and then let's let's show you okay so this is how the thickness is decided okay. and i think once it is done we can take it out in this way right or something i will check that taken this out from the package and as I said different options are given here for the uh, thickness of the julian slices julians or the vegetable slices we can decide on okay? and we have to just remove it in this way this I think these two blades are for julians and then we can just let it down like this okay and this is the stand we can decide okay And have a look from side how it looks like. Okay. Side if you cut, this is how it looks like. Okay, fine. Now you can. The thing I have just I have washed a potato. Let's see, it's tightly fit. Okay. And now I'll decide on the thickness of K5. So I am going to keep it bit thin. I have actually set it at uh, 3mm. Okay, fine. So I am setting it at 3mm over here. Hmm? 3 mm and then let's cut. Okay. Wow. Seems to be effortless. That is quite neat. Okay. Very smooth. Very smooth. I have cut it into um, thickness of 2 mm or 3 mm actually. I fixed the thickness of 3 mm. It's beautiful. Okay. It has come out very nicely. I am actually, uh, this is the first time I am using this mandolin. So, I'm actually very happy with this product. I'll keep on posting you when I am going to use other options as well. Today I thought I'll make some aloo ka bhaji, okay, some potato fries. So I have just cut it in this way, and I'll decide on other. So this is fine, not bad. Okay, I just wash the potato and I've sliced it. Okay, pause it, huh? Wow, this is really smooth. Now I am actually loving it. I have, a, I have just fixed the thickness of the slice to 3 mm. Okay, over here. And now I am just planning to make some bacon, some brinjal fry. Wow. Just be careful with your fingers. The blades, uh, the blade seems to be very sharp. So, this is beautiful. Sorry. So, I have kept the thickness at 3 mm. Beautifully cut. Slicing brinjal is very difficult and I am going to make brinjal bhaji also. With, uh, in Bengal we call it beguni. So I wanted to cut it in this thickness. It has come out very nicely. Very nice.
Okay, friends. So, this is a, a new vegetable slicer we bought from Amazon.co.uk for twenty-one pounds and eighty-nine pence, and uh, I just uh, sliced um, one big potato and one big brinzel, and it was really good. Though this is my first time usage. So I don't know whether this uh, uh, you know, sharpness in the blade is going to remain afterward or not. But right now I am actually happy with the product. Though I am not very uh, happy in the way that was sent to us, the, the packaging. As I said, it was packed in a big paper envelope. And uh, the box is strong so that uh, you know, the inside packaging was good. But uh, it was just put in a big envelope. The envelope was not even big enough to hold the box. Okay, so kind of open from one end. So I'm, I'm not happy with the packaging. But the product seems to be good. And uh, uh, today I just, uh, you know, for, just for the video, I had sliced uh, one potato and brinjal and it came out well. As and when I'll use, I'll... Uh, if you posted if I face any issues or any different experience with this mandolin. So thank you.